yeah welcome back welcome back right here on the magazine show yes that was our first guest mr crazy you know big shout out man um award um nominate pet new international act you know in the studio the show goes on yeah like i said it's a magazine show from pack show this very very afternoon it's all about leadership you know and this lady She's a leadership expert, you know. She does in the, She's a friend of the show. She's a family of the show, of the channel, the whole Ben TV channel, not even magazine show. I'm talking the whole Ben TV, you know. And she does a lot of hosting. She does a lot. You, you know what? I'm going to let her introduce herself. But ladies and just gentlemen, good afternoon. Let me introduce to you, Princess Holiday. Thank you. Thank Hi. you very much. Yay, that was great. <laughs> <laughs> I tried, I tried, I tried. Thank How you, you doing? Me. You're welcome. Wow, you. you're looking, you know. As usual. Oh, thank you. I you try. Know? Did I say welcome <laughs> to London from LA, from Virginia, from America? Yes. How long have you been in town for now? I've been here for what, about four days now. Four days, yes, yeah. I, I saw this selfie. You've been central <laughs> London. You've been, you know. Yeah. I see. <laughs> and I've been doing a lot of appearances and yeah. speaking. Yeah. It's been going very well so far. Yeah. Why leadership expert? That's a very good question. So as I traveled across the globe for over two decades, interviewing people all over the world and finding out issues that we as a nation encounter, I noticed that the one thing that everyone concentrates on is our leadership. People believe that the one reason we've had stalled system for so long is due to our leadership. So I decided to dive in a few years ago and get a master's in leadership Wow. And then proceeded to currently pursuing a PhD in leadership and educating people on how to lead authentically. What we need yeah. is authentic leadership. Authentic, not like the one we've got in Africa. Should I mention, <laughs> I don't know, uh, what kind of leadership we got in Africa? Is that authentic? Well, what kind of leadership I'm we got in Nigeria? Sure, is that authentic? <laughs> No, is that authentic though? What well, we got in Nigeria right now? Is authentic, authentic leadership, in my definition, yeah. <laughs> is an approach to leadership that accentuates building a leader's legitimacy through yeah. honesty, openness, vulnerability. Authentic leaders are not afraid to share their weaknesses at all. Mm. They understand that the journey to actually identifying life is endless. Wow. They put the interest of the nation ahead of their own. What we need today in Africa is authentic leadership. Okay, yeah, and you are there to educate them about that. That's what yeah. I do. Yeah, so that's, that's what, what you do. So, mm -hmm. you, what, you must be making a lot of precedence now. Well, wow. I think that it's important that we instill emotional intelligence yeah. and, and leadership knowledge in every person available because that's what we need to move the world forward, if you ask me. Yeah. But when we talk about leadership, it doesn't just go with the, those that want to lead a country. Even Not the goes with a company director, yes. or a TV producer, it, it doesn't matter. Yeah. You can be a leader yourself, you know yes. what I mean? In leadership person, yeah. is in every kind of, every avenue you find yourself. We all lead in leader. one way or the other. I mean, the world is about carrying out exchange with people. Mm. So we lead in different spheres of our life. Oh, like, yes. Yeah. And talking about leadership, like you say, leadership has to be open, you know, and have to yes. lead in the right way. Yes. You and know? you know something, and in Africa, where we're from, you know, that we're not thought to be open. We believe that being so stern, mm. being so strict and being so hard is the way to actually exude in these behaviors or traits of leadership. Mm. But that is incorrect. A leader has to embrace vulnerability, embrace openness, be free to speak, be free to share your weakness, be free to laugh, and not be so tight. Tight, and yeah. Minded as but we got, we get that a lot of leadership in Africa, even Nigeria right now, as to speak, because you know a lot of people complain anyway. But talking about leadership, how do we impact that on our young ones, on the youths right now, who's looking up to all these? so-called leaders at the moment how do we kind of change their, their mindset, mindset yes. you know that that's not that kind of leadership right. because that kind of leadership in africa has been going for over 50 years and it seems it's still going so how do we change the mindset of the young ones right now that's a very good question well first thing is education we have to keep educating everyone the young people the leaders themselves, everyone needs to be educated. Mm. And there's something called leadership reforms. I think it's important that we instill these reforms in every organization from the bottom up. up yeah. It's important that everyone gets to understand that 
We need emotional intelligence. You need empathy. You need social skills. You need self-awareness. You need all of this value to be able to really go forth. And you need motivation. Yeah. All of these are important. And we have to change the way that we've ascribed leadership to be in all of these years. I think that if we begin to see things differently yeah. and open our mind, broaden our horizons, things will be entirely different. Yeah. So are you watching now? If they want to get hold of you, like they need some leadership skills, how do they go about it? Oh, we have our information online. I'm on Instagram. I'm very active these days. Yeah, learning. I can tell. <laughs> I can tell. I see yeah, that every uh, day. Yeah. Uh, Princess Halliday official. Yeah. I'm also on Twitter. Mm -hmm. I think that's at Princess Halliday and yeah. Facebook. Yeah. I try to use those platforms as best as I can. Yeah. So what about the African artists right now? We've got yes. loads of African yes. artists that is coming yes. every yes. day. Yes. Yes. You know, they, they too could be leadership. They could they could gain from this, yes. really and truly, you yes. know. So what's your advice to them, like African artists? Well, first thing first, I want to commend all of what African artists are putting out there. It's extraordinary. It's great. Like every day when I go to the gym, all yeah. I do is listen to it. African. Who's your favorite? Music? Who's your favorite? Oh, there's right so now. Much. Who, this, who are you listening this, this to? This T was Savage. This, uh, yeah, wow. This she's, got, she's got a concert on the 24th of is August. It? Yeah, in London. Oh, Massive. I love, at the O2 I, I love yeah. this tech. No, Techno. it's Davido, who I really oh, wow. also love. Heavy, heavy. There's a lot of them. Fino, Fino, Pink. Fino, Fino. Peace <laughs> <laughs> Square. Peace Square, yeah. They're all, they're yes, all amazing. Yes, yes. It makes me so happy when I listen to this music and I see the sort of progress yeah. that's been made, especially in Africa, yeah. during this time in music. It is definitely fascinating. I think these guys are going over and beyond trying to make sure that they implement these things yeah. that are never deemed That's why, how can they in, impact that leadership in their life as an artist? Is it possible for them? Oh, yes. Being an artist and impact that leadership? Oh, yes. Yeah. Now, leadership can be learned. Mm. The, the values of leadership, the attributes can be learned. Okay. It definitely can be learned. A person has to be willing to understand how to operate as a leader mm -hmm. and then also increase whatever understanding they have towards fulfilling their goals. Yeah. And leadership is also sharing with those coming behind you, isn't it? If you're a leader, you have to share, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Better know your money, though. Better just the idea. <laughs> well, well, I always say to people that great leaders extend their circle of influence. So the most junior person can feel like they belong. There has to be a sense of belonging amongst everyone okay. in leadership towards the goal or the vision that you've set forward. It's very important. Is there any procedures of being a leadership? Like, There's something I, yeah, so I'm sorry, I No, no, I ahead. think they say we have to go on a break. Okay. We have to okay. go on a break because okay. I've got like a few questions okay. regarding leadership because me too, I want to be a leader. You are know. a leader. Uh, what are you talking about? Oh, I'm here. a leader. <laughs> hey, did you hear that? You know, yeah, but I'm a leader, guys. Uh, we're going to go on a short break now, guys. We're going to yeah. go on a short break. We'll see you straight after this.